Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Catman Joe and welcome back to another brand new video. Today guys, if you couldn't tell by the title of the video, we are doing another brand new build. Now, I just want to begin by saying guys, thank you all for over 80 subscribers. It really is unreal and it really is so appreciated. I also just want to shout out, and I'm pretty sure I've already done this, um, but Flash Games or Flash the Gamer, he's a really great guy. Um, he currently just lost his Wi-Fi. I know it's a little bit like you know random to kind of bring up in the top of a, a topic of a video but i really do want to shout him out i just want to let him know when he does eventually get wi-fi back and watches this he's a great fan of uh and a great part of the community and i hope he really does get it back soon so i just wanted to give him a little bit of a shout there i, I don't know he really wanted me to do it so i really want to help him out now guys if you can't tell already we are back and today guys i finally got a whole new creative world i have been working with a team of four other people guys to build this place honestly it has took us a quite a while actually but you guys probably see already from the map this place is massive now this is a maze plaza or um the maze building even like maze bank from grand theft auto 5 um yeah guys you can see i have been doing a lot of stuff i bought this massive circle that goes around here it's like the interstate it's not finished that's why parts of the road are kind of broke and um it's also why there's a few other things that do look kind of what's the word incomplete even because guys we've really only been working on this uh, build for only just a few days now not really like days upon days upon days it's honestly only been a few days but this is just it came along so fast guys you guys can see we built so much sick stuff now getting into the proper video guys, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to build this bad boy. Now I think I showed you guys how to build this on my last channel, but if you guys didn't see that video, you guys are in for a treat today. Now if you haven't built this already, or if you have, but I'm, I'm 9, 9 out of 10 people watching this video probably haven't built this. Now this is, this can be used as a little skyscraper, a mini version, or it can also be used as an actual like apartment complex. Now me personally, I use it as an apartment complex, this one's actually just completely empty though. Um, but I will be giving you guys a example obviously you know like this is what it looks like now But if this video gets over 15 likes guys I will do an interior design and make another video for next week on how to do the interior for this place now to put in every single floor Apartment room layout and also like a small ele um, elevator thing to get up to all the bedrooms So guys to build this building this is going to be the part that's really your choice here You are going to need quartz that's going to be the one main thing Now this part that's your choice guys what kind of clay do you guys want to use for your building? This one is orange, and I would suggest using the same glass as the clay that you use. Um, unless it's an incredibly dark color, like you know, like these ones here where it says blue hardened clay, which is clearly purple, so you can use purple glass for that. But today, guys, we're going to be using some lime because, you know, I don't know, racing green and I think racing orange is such an awesome color. So we're going to be using a uh, lime hardened clay. Then we're also going to be using some lime stained glass. And that's basically it, guys. Now, you're also additionally, you're going to need a few other things, guys, um, such as stone slabs. You're also going to need wood and where are they uh, wooden planks there they are. And that will just be for the floors, guys. And if you do do more floors, it is just wooden planks all the way up, guys. Now, I'm pretty sure I've done the right estimates here. You're going to need a space by 17 by 17. Pretty straightforward, pretty simple. I've actually already got a little mapped, up, mapped out over here because uh, there's the main building there. And yeah, I've already got it kind of mapped out. So what you're going to want to do, guys, is go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. On the other side, 2, 3. Remember to count this one here. So 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then, you're going to go, then what you're going to want to do is go 1, 2, 3. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now this is still seven. I was just counting up from there, but that's seven and seven. It's always seven all the way around, guys. And then one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven one two three now the part is here guys you can either put the doors on this one here you could put it on this one over here you know the one over there you can pick which side you want the door to be on i suggest just maybe having it here because that's quite perfect really and there you go that really is kind of the hardest part over but we're going to fill in the doorway gap here guys it doesn't really matter for that right this very second so then what we're going to want to do guys is just build up now each floor should have i think and i'm looking at this one over here i'm pretty sure it is six actual window frames and then it switches so we're going to do it like this guys to about there i would say um but if we want to count it we'll actually just count it then two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen i'd say i'd say it's about 14 high or 16 high one or two but uh basically guys you just want to do this then this so that's technically two windows and these all have glass filled in the inside of them so that's two three that's four i was way off <laughs> um five which is 16 17 18 19 yeah so it's 19 high 
six so you're going to want to do this guys now once you've done this you're just going to want to do this on each side here guys so for the corners as well pretty simply just do it the same as this one here just connect them though and hold on, let me just try and do this as fast as possible guys to show you it and give you guys a little bit of a better understanding on how it'll look that was wrong <laughs> um, and everyone should be too wide so basically it's like just this like just like this guy's perfect height and that's really it guys this is like the first kind of stage now this will be on the top and the bottom but you're basically just going to keep mirroring this all the way around and all the way up guys now what i'm going to do is i'm going to quickly fast forward from here guys to when i've actually put in all the window parts around the entire building and i've put the stain clay up to the right height so i'll be back in a second guys once i've done that all right guys so there we go and it's finally done guys i only took it me just a few more minutes but i just didn't really want to have you guys having to watch me do all this now for the purpose of this video guys i'm going to put the glass in last but if i was you i definitely suggest putting the glass in first kind of thing as you go up every floor just putting the glass so basically you don't have to come back to it and do it all last but for this purpose of this video guys i'm going to do that last and probably off camera as well so you're at this part guys, you built all six floors and it's looking alright. I mean personally I could still use that as a little apartment. It's not exactly very big but you know it's a cool little apartment idea. I mean you could definitely put three floors in there, bottom, middle and top. But you guys want to make it a lot bigger. Now this is the part where it gets really easy again guys. So you just want to do this on every single part around here guys. Simply just go around and do this. Now this is really it. Like I know it may seem like you know that's a little bit too simple Joe. But honestly guys, this is it. There's not a lot to this part of the glitch, um, this part of the glitch, uh, this part guys, there is not really that much to it to be honest. Now you just want to go around continuous placing like that. Now once you've done that, this will be where your windows come. So basically what happens guys, is your windows will go from being five wide and two like, well two wide and five long. They'll go to four long and two wide still. Um, so basically guys, like this, they'll still be the exact same except from they'll close in like that guys. And hopefully that should be pretty self-explanatory. Now we're just going to want to go up a little bit more again, just a little bit higher here, and do this again guys. Now, as the same as before guys, there's going to be six floors here, so there's going to be like here, one, two, three, four, five, six. Up here there's going to be six as well, so that's two, that's three, four, five, and six guys. Now I'm not going to skip this part here, I'm actually going to put this part in here guys. Uh, I'm going to build this and build the front face and show you guys how it should look and then um, yeah guys I'll skip the rest and kind of fast forward to me when I've actually finished the second part guys. So to be honest there's only really three major parts to this build guys. There's the first six floors um, which can be a little bit more annoying but once you get them done that's it. Then it's the next which is the second part guys which is the next six mini floors kind of thing is what I would call them. They aren't many they're still the same size but the, the next many ones even and then there's the last six main ones now i'm pretty sure you kind of get the gist on how the next six will work but if you guys don't don't worry i'll show you guys how to do that as well right after i've done this part here guys now also before the video ends guys and if you guys are enjoying it so far and if you guys really are um or if you guys really do find this glitch helpful make sure to subscribe and like the video it would be really appreciated i know that will ask you guys before the end of the video as well but please if you guys could it'd be really appreciated now there we go guys, that is another 6 floors in the middle, so it goes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, then 6 in the bottom, right? So currently guys, we're at 12, now this will go up to 18 obviously, like this one guys, this is obviously a massive one, but you can make them smaller and you know, I'll probably end up in the future give you guys some more examples of what they look like, what they look like if they're smaller guys. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to like pretty quickly just build all the sides up again, like what I've done for the very bottom part, and yeah guys, after I've done that, I will return and show you guys it done. Alright, so there we go guys, and it's finally done. We've done the second floor guys, or the second part even, and it's looking pretty good. Now, if you're following along this far, now I'm pretty sure you're not, I'm pretty sure you kind of just paused, caught up, and then now you're here, or you're just still watching and waiting until the end to kind of build it yourself. But that's fine either way, but legit guys, this is looking pretty nice now. Now we've got a really nice looking building, but what do we need guys? We're missing one part, which is the top. Now the next part, pretty self-explanatory, you just really need to build and do what you've done on the bottom floor guys, like this. Now, this is why I'm going to show you guys this, because I have seen people try and build this for themselves from being in my world, or trying to build it in my world, and honestly they make such cock-ups of it. It really is quite funny, but it's also quite annoying because, you know, it just can be quite irritating. So what you guys want to do is this, guys. Now, a lot of people will just genuinely think that you should just leave it like this, where it's like this little floating part here. Just like this, guys. But that doesn't look too nice. I really do not like the look of that. I think it looks pretty disgusting. So if I was you, I'd do like that. Just go all the way around doing this. 
And as long as you do this, guys, it'll match the bottom part and it will not make your world and you look like a complete twat. Now, we keep going round. All the way. And there we go. Right. So now we're ready, guys. Now we just got to put in the next six floors. Now, I don't know if I even need to show you guys this. I'm pretty sure it is, again, pretty self-explanatory. But I am going to do it anyway, guys. So, there we go. That's two... And this will be three. That's four. Jeez. <laughs> four. That's five. And then this should by all rights be six. Now, guys, again, it is pretty self-explanatory. I mean, it's just copying the bottom part and just rebuilding it all the way up, guys. And for here as well, you just need to do this and fill it all in. Now, before the video ends, obviously, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to show you guys how to put on the roof or how the roof will look. I'm also going to show you guys what it will look like once we put in all the actual like wooden planks and stuff because we still got to do all that good stuff. And I'll also show you guys the entire place with glass in it. Now, I will not be showing you guys, I repeat, I will not be showing you guys the entire place fully done up with all the bedrooms and floors and stuff because, you know, one, I think that is just a little bit too long to show you guys all that. And two, I will show you guys that maybe in a future video. So if this video, if you guys do enjoy it and you guys do want to build this in your world but you guys don't really know a really good design for the place or the hotel or the apartments or whatever just pretty simply pre <laughs> wow i just got really put off just pretty simply guys just leave a like and if you guys leave a like and this video gets to 15 likes then what i'll do is i'll bring a part two of this video guys and show you how to build the interior which honestly looks absolutely utterly stunning guys i will definitely have to show you guys how to do it but you yeah, guys so there we go i'm going to stop here guys and i will return back in a second once we've actually got all the like actual building done and also all the glass put in so back in a second guys once we have done that all right guys so there we go and we're finally done and there we go that is the third floor put in guys and it looks pretty good i'm not gonna lie i really do love the look of the green i wasn't a thousand percent with the green color guys originally i wasn't even going to use the lime green i was actually going to use a dark green because i've used it before but i'm really happy i used the lime green with the lime green gr uh, glass it really does suit very well in this world and it's really colorful and that's the whole point guys we want really colorful beautiful and really nice buildings just in general guys so that's it basically guys now we just got to put on the roof now this part is not hard at all i'm pretty sure it's very self-explanatory you want to have it one off the edge and then just very simply go around the edge guys and just pull i well, know just fill the entire roof in now there was a little mistake that i noticed that i had done on the last skyscraper which was actually pretty crazy i hadn't even noticed you guys maybe have to notice now but if you guys don't it's actually the fact that i didn't add these parts in under here so once you get to the roof you just want to cap this off very nice like that now you can choose either to not have it i mean it doesn't really make that big a difference but i think it looks a little bit better with it just added in there guys it's such a little extra detail but it looks really nice and if you if you do add it into every single top part or every single side I don't know, it just adds something extra, guys. And it looks like there's a little bit more going on. And I think it really just adds a little bit more detail into it, guys. Now, also, I've already asked, guys. But if you did enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like. And it would be really appreciated, obviously, guys. Um, and I hope you all know that genuinely to do this, I did not want to make any more building videos. I honestly refused to make any more building videos until I had a, susta like a sustainable creative world. Um, so the last one that you guys watched, which was how to build the best survival house, I think it was, that was actually not even on this world. That was just on a random world, and I was like, you know what, I don't have to start a whole random world, but, you know, I have to, because I accidentally deleted the old one, which was my main one kind of thing, or my main creative world with my Firestone City survival world as well. But now at least, guys, we have actually officially got this as our main creative world, and I am honestly so happy for the results. Um, there's quite a few people to thank for this. It's Cal the Gamer, Wesley Toss, you know, a few other people as well. And they genuinely did help out big time with this, guys. They helped put a lot of design and they helped also do a lot of the roads because when it turns night, the entire city actually lights up, guys. Um, there's another little hidden feature that I'm not really wanting to do right now, but uh, the place can actually snow. This is actually in a snow biome. Although, although there is no snow anywhere near, uh, it's just because I've actually got it turned off. But genuinely, guys, this place will be covered in snow if I turn on the weather cycle, which is why i currently have it off so yeah guys and that's us almost done we're just going to do this last little roll here and then the next one now that's us there we go guys so that is the roof done and let me just have a look at it from far back that looks really good guys now for the final little touch all i'm going to do guys is simply go down here knock my doorway back in 
come inside and just clear this entire place out and add in the oak wood and once i do this guys that is us done that is honestly the entire hotel apartment um house i mean you could just turn this into your own single house i do know though when you do add the floors in and stuff this place does become a quite a relatively large apartment honestly guys like so i mean this would not be really good as just a single house but i mean if you guys really did want to and you guys had enough room and you guys had enough ideas for it you could definitely do it guys you could definitely, definitely do it. Now, if you guys also keep hearing whistling and random noises in the background, let me just explain as well very quickly while we do this. Basically, guys, uh, I'm pretty I'm pretty sure everybody knows him already, but if you guys don't, there's this guy called Ali, who is basically the guy that I stay with. And right now, he's playing Grand Theft Auto V, guys. Now, he's playing it on Xbox 360, which is a console I used to play it on. Um, and the console I still do play, just not all the time, guys. But he currently is just in a moddy game, and there's many guns on his shoulders. There's donuts on him. And the lightning bolts looks like right around them. I know he looks like basically the main man and now there's some other shit going on. So <laughs> that's why I've been kind of just like quite off put for it. some of the things I've been speaking about guys. It's basically just because of Ali. He just keeps sitting telling me how this modder or something's doing some weird stuff to him. But I know. Oh, and uh, I thought he just died but he didn't. Okay. But yeah guys, so this is basically it. Now, as I said, if you guys do want to see a part 2 of this, and if you guys do want to see the full building totally renovated, and you guys want to learn how to put in all the floors and turn this into a proper apartment complex, make sure or be sure to drop a like, guys. As I already said, it would be very, very, very much appreciated. And another shout out again goes to my friend Flash Games. An awesome guy, he's been a massive supporter of the channel. I really do want to start shouting people out, at least one, uh, one person or one new person every single video. But um, I really just wanted to shout out Flash, guys. The channel won't be down below. I mean, I just, I don't know. I might, I might not. I probably, I, know, I probably will forget to, guys. And I probably won't. But um, I just, I want to shout him out because it's a shame. He's just lost Wi-Fi, if you guys don't know. And it basically means he can't watch the videos, guys, and just can't really support us and our little journey, guys, to back up to at least 500 subscribers again. And there we go. The one last miniature little feature, and that's it there. And boom. Look at that guys, that is a very successful looking apartment and the inside actually looks really quite nice guys, it is a massive apartment like a lot of the other ones and just wow guys in general and just just wow i mean it does look honestly unbelievable and it looks a lot better than what i expected guys i love the fact that you can actually come down here to the actual paths of the higher up roads and you can see this and it looks so 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 good although these grass things are in the way but anyway guys, thank you for watching today's video. If you guys did go to enjoy it, make sure or be sure to drop a massive like. It would be really, really, really appreciated guys. It does help out the channel and these videos a ton. Also make sure to subscribe if you haven't already because I upload daily content on Minecraft with tips, tricks, tutorials and glitches. And other than that guys, I'll see you on tomorrow's video. I love you all and peace out guys. Wherever love goes, there is also misery. It's no mystery. And you and I, we got history, yeah Wherever love flows, there is also tragedy When we're in too deep And you and I, we got history, yeah